68-year-old woman with a remote history of breast cancer presenting with low back pain to a chiropractic clinic in Hong Kong with imaging findings consistent with a vertebral hemangioma and vertebral metastatic lesions. Patients commonly visit chiropractic clinics for treatment for low back pain, which is often due to injury or degenerative spinal conditions. Rarely, serious underlying pathology may be identified. This report describes a 68-year-old woman with a remote history of breast cancer presenting with low back pain to a chiropractic clinic in Hong Kong with imaging findings consistent with vertebral hemangioma and vertebral metastatic lesions. A 68-year-old woman with a history of breast cancer status after chemotherapy and mastectomy 20 years prior presented to a chiropractor with an acute exacerbation of chronic low back pain with lower extremity paresthesia. She previously visited her general practitioner and underwent radiography, which supported diagnoses of degenerative lumbar spondylosis and hemangioma of the fifth lumbar vertebra. Given the patient's worsening status and previous cancer, the chiropractor ordered lumbar magnetic resonance imaging at the initial visit, consistent with multilevel spinal metastasis. The chiropractor referred the patient to an oncologist who performed positron emission tomography computed tomography, which suggested breast cancer recurrence and metastasis. The greatest hypermetabolic activity was evident within the level of the suspected vertebral hemangioma, suggesting this finding which initially appeared innocuous on plain radiography contained underlying metastasis. This study is published at American Journal of Case Reports in PubMed.